we're going on a tour this morning and um, we're going uh, to Ras Mohammed National Park and then we're also going scuba diving which is like a whole thing there's a lot of things to do which is stopping on different islands we're gonna be on a boat so it's gonna be very interesting I'm very scared <laughs> because I can't swim but I'm gonna try my very hardest that's the best that I can do right been to collect some masks uh, for swimming and some um, life jackets um, it's really busy there's so many people here the boats are outside <laughs> um, yeah so we're all just sitting and chatting and waiting for um, the boats to come I guess because uh, we're going on a boat ride so the view here was really nice um, they're talking about vaccines <laughs> so yeah is it? Eh? Who? Oh, the woman you guys are talking to. Oh, is she Italian? Yeah, she's German. She's German. Oh, okay. I should have said. German. She's oh, she's very friendly. friendly. No, Germans are nice. People have a negative stereotype. We are not going to despite it something. Because I don't know, but these are the. Yo, is it a yacht or a boat? It's a boat, ba? The boats have different names. I swear that. I said I never put my phone finish. so scared hmm god literally last night i was sleeping well i mean before i go sleep okay she last night mm -hmm. i may mean, think of this thing like oh my god like Why? yes because i have anxiety about water i do too but we're fine so if i can manage this you can do anything yeah so i actually need to take off this jacket because it's just the diving only for now there's three different stops on the boat and we're going to be diving and snorkeling at each stop depending on if you want to i need to do at least one of each at each at one stop or the other so yeah the view is is impeccable though unmatched amazing shockingly beautiful we have problems first problems when we start to go down under the water so you will get pressure like when you fly so what you will do to get pressure blow it out right up to your ear you must do the flies yeah you know how we can do the flies yeah good okay pressure then what after doing the instructions and the lessons and telling us what to do, like how to go up, how to say you're not okay, underwater, etc. Um, that was really helpful. Then we went and got suited and booted. We did a lot of like forms filling and making sure like health declarations, making sure everyone's okay to do what we're about to do. And then we finally got into the water. I was absolutely terrified like my heart was shaking everything in my body was shaking i don't even remember the experience because i was so so scared so i literally didn't know what i was doing you can see my instructors with me there literally behind me like i just mm, he was so supportive i feel like i almost breathed in all the oxygen before i went underwater 
he was like look at me don't look anywhere else just look at me breathing we're like doing breathing exercises so that i could because i literally went into like panic mode because i was so so scared so if i can go scuba diving i feel like absolutely anyone can with an instructor obviously on the water one thing as well that they don't tell you is the pressure so the pressure in my head was so so bad but then it's like the sim similar pressure that you get on planes but luckily i've learned how to deal with the plane pre uh, plane pressure but like obviously pulling air out through your ears but if you don't know how to do that then you might struggle to do scuba diving because the pressure obviously you're going below sea level the pressure and then the water obviously water pressure on your head can be a lot and my sisters really really struggled and both of them halfway maybe even less than halfway gave up and 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 came back up so that's one thing need to remember Um, island called um, White Island. It's literally just like a small like patch of land in the middle of the Red Sea. Um, not in the middle, quite in the middle of the Red Sea, but in the Red Sea. Um, and it's so funny because me and my sisters are like grandmas. <laughs> We're like three grandmothers. We're just like can't swim. It's quite embarrassing as well because obviously like we were only, the only four black people on the um, on the thing on the boat or on the, the ship is this a boat is this a ship i don't even know what it is now but we're the only black people there basically and we're the only people who couldn't swim yeah i've been doing swimming lessons right i think for me it's it's kind of different as well because i just have a genuine fear for water because i almost drowned as a kid so that's something that i'm sort of working on but again massive shout out to our um instructor scuba driver or scuba, why do i keep saying scuba driving scuba diving instructor he was incredibly supportive like he literally took all three of us like we're going in the water and he's like okay do this hold on to this like you're gonna be fine and then oh he was just so so lovely i don't really know what company they work for so i can't really i don't really know who to recommend and you know how to say okay you can go with this person if that's something you care for but honestly the absolute best the absolute best but the island itself is kind of cute like i think I, I wasn't too like excessively impressed or anything but the island is cute and it was nice to see a bit of white sand because the red sea the sand by the red sea is typically like a reddish or like a reddish brown sort of tone so this was kind of nice and it was given zanzibar which is like white white sand everywhere so yes it was really really lovely It's really loud. Apparently 
see the dolphin. I didn't see the dolphin. I can't believe I went scuba diving. It's actually unreal. Oh, actually, I need to check the videos. Eh? You went half scuba diving. My sister got too much pressure on her head. And yeah, it was crazy. But I can't believe we're done. This was really nice. We got had lunch. That was really, really lovely. I love to see the sun setting as well. Let me get a video. Lunch was really nice. The food is actually quite nice that we had for lunch. Um, and yeah, it's just been a good day. It's been a chill day. Apart from the fear of like scuba diving, it has been really nice. Um, we're gonna be going back home soon. The sun is setting. The view is actually insane. It's really lovely. It's really, really nice. for this evening and the sun is setting the sunset looks so nice oh look at this at the boats the tip of the boats we're going home yes yeah it's not why didn't you have to tell him we're just coming back home the sun is setting our hotel at the moment um and yeah that's the end of this one today we're going to go to mount sinai tonight which is going to be very interesting but yep Thank you so much for watching this vlog and I shall see you on the next one. Bye!